recently some towers were slightly changed and also of course the new towers were added down here as you can see so we are going to be making another tower tier list let's do this i would say the armored factory is s tier it is not completely ss tier but it is an extremely strong tower artillery is pretty a tier i mean it's not necessarily b tier but it's not necessarily on the level of this so i'll put it there but it is really good for crowd control and it's good at what it does the barracks, I would put that at like B tier honestly, the armored factory just outclasses it a ton. It might even be C tier in my opinion, I just do not like the barracks like most people do. Uh, the cryo blaster, I would put it at A tier. It can be SS tier sometimes, sometimes it's F tier, so I'll just average it out and put it at like A. Same for the cryo ranger, but I'll actually put it just a bit lower, I'd say the barracks has more use overall, oh and the artillery definitely has more use overall but they are about in that tier. The EDJ is pretty S tier, not SSS maybe. It might even be SSS, but it is, of course, one of the most essential support units in the game right now, so I'm putting it there. The farm is... Ever since Endless Mode, it has started to appear even more useful. So I'll put it here, but it's not necessarily on the level of what EDJ can do to help you. The Grenadier... Uh... It's pretty S tier now, well it has been S tier and I recognized that before too, but with Endless Road now it's just even better in the meta, so I'll put it even above Armored Factory just for that. The John I will put at like A tier, it can help you about a similar amount as the farm can. They're just good extra utility if you need them, so I'll put them around the same area. John may be a bit more useful. The regular Juggernaut, I will put about here. Because it doesn't have the best, uh... It, it can't... What's it called? For bulletproof uh, enemies, it doesn't really do well against those. But other than that, he's pretty good for the cost. And yeah. The Laser Gunner is still pretty S tier, even after Endless. Uh, it might actually even be... Yeah, about there. That The Laser Gunner is still really good. I might even put it SS tier, but Golden Ranger kind of outclasses it now, so maybe not. The Mine Layer really has not been in the meta, like, at all. So I'll put it in F tier, I'm, I'm going to be honest. Um, Missile Trooper, we can put this... Um, I saw some people do some good things with it, so it might be A tier, but I'll put it at the very top of B tier. Uh, the Operator is also just around this sort of... It might even be C tier, actually. I'll put it at C tier. The Patrol Boat seems to have about the same kind of usage rate as the Missile Trooper. It might even be a bit better, so I'll put it there. It, it has really good stats for the cost, though. It might even be A tier. But for now, I'll put it at B. Railgunner is also pretty A tier along the... Maybe a bit better than Juggernaut, just because of the Endless update, actually. Might even be there. Alright, well then... Uh, I'll put them here. Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, Ranger is pretty C-tier as well. Shotgunner, also been pretty C-tier recently. Sniper, I really haven't seen anybody use Sniper recently, so I'll put it at B-tier, but... That's probably just because of all the other stuff are classing it. It's probably still like A tier or something. Uh, Toxic Nader. I'll put it at uh, B tier because it doesn't help you with damage as much as John does with the support buff, but it is somewhat useful and also you can also use it as a DPS. I'll just put it at B tier. The Warship is pretty S tier right now. I wouldn't say SS tier. Because I am saving that for Golden Juggernaut. This thing is just the best tower in the game right now. Uh, it just has so much DPS. And it has a surprising amount of range for Juggernaut. So yeah, Golden Juggernaut goes all the way up there. Golden Ranger is also pretty S tier. It's just a bit better than Laser Gunner. That's pretty much what you can say about it. And the XWM turret, I am not going to lie to you, is not that good. I mean... In endless mode, when you have an infinite amount of money, sure, it's good. But that's literally the only place where it's pretty much usable. Just endless mode. 
it would be way better to just use like any other of these DPS's in any other mode. Oh yeah, I did not mean to put that up there. So yeah, there is my tier list. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.